Hey guys, Dr. Tim Padlack here, talking about a little bit of core strengthening today in a functional position, but as opposed to that upright standing position with some of the band stuff that we talked about in previous videos, I want to do something lying down on your back that's a little bit less aggressive. Um, it could be good for someone who has shoulder pain when they're trying to do functional core strength for low back pain or just for sport. So if you start in this position with your feet bent up to that 90 degree angle and your hands are under the small of your back, what your hands are acting as as pressure sensors. So as we're going through this, you should never feel more or less pressure on your hands that are under the small of your back. That should stay the same. You're gonna start by taking a deep breath in and breathing out. As you breathe out, I want you to think about tightening down rectus abdominis and oblique. So somewhere to come and push here or push on the inside, it should feel equally firm. You're not just flexing your abs, you're flexing your core and muscles that are associated with that. Along with it, there should be no pressure change where your hands are under your back. So when I breathe in, I breathe out, I tighten, I tighten. There's no pressure change where this hand is. I want you to hold that for 10 seconds. If you're able to hold that for 10 seconds, repeat that five times. And if it's not fatiguing or not challenging, then you start to progress. There are three different ways to progress. Each one would be the same rep range five times for a 10 second hold with different movement patterns. This is easy. There's no fatigue here. We'll hold that five times 10 seconds. I want you to start with raising both of your elbows off the ground. Hands are on the back. My elbows are not elevated off the ground. Just barely kind of floating there. And go through five times 10 seconds. Continue along when this is easy. Go through and go one leg, barely elevated off the ground. And you can do this obviously on both sides, five times 10 seconds. And the last one is both elbows off the ground, one leg off the ground, and now your head not flexed but unweighted. Think there's a scale under your head and you're just unweighting that portion, holding this position where my elbows are up, my leg is up, and my head is slightly elevated, unweighted off that scale, all while holding tension in the rectus and into the obliques, performing functional core strength, not in a bent or a flex position. This would be good for a lot of people who are already doing some of the upright core stability stuff, but starting to feel some wear and tear on their shoulders. This is a little less aggressive and you can do it before you fall asleep at night. All right, I'll talk to you guys soon.